This segment of Hack 5 is brought to you by The Ben Heck Show. For Hack 5, I'm Darren Kitchen at DEF CON 2011 with a man that needs no introduction. Johnny Long, how are you? My favorite Good. expat <laughs> slash charitable man of all sorts of hacker goodness, right? Good to see you, man. Yeah. It's been too long. It's been yeah. too long. So what's, what's been going on in Uganda? Um, lots of uh, malaria. Okay. That's a good place to start. Um, had my first bout of malaria. That was absolutely no joke. You wow. Know, it was. Uh, it's like the. Uh, it was like the worst flu I've ever had. Well, I'm happy to see you here out. healthy. Yeah. I'm yeah. As healthy as you can be in Vegas, right? Yeah. Well, you know, but, it's, yeah. it's good to see you back in the states at the at the cons promoting all the great stuff that you're doing with iHack Charities. And of course, everybody that watches Hack Five knows about the organization, but there's been some cool changes. So I really want to get an update on. Uh, on, on all the new developments. Sure, sure. Yeah, you guys have been really cool supporters, I mean, through the years, so thanks for doing that. Of course. Um, so this has been kind of a year of learning. We figured out a lot of stuff. We did a lot of things uh, wrong and learned from them. Uh, we're, we're doing, a, we have a, an internet cafe and a restaurant in Uganda, which is called The Keep. Yeah. And uh, it's, it's proven to be a really good way to meet expats and meet tourists and meet organizations that are doing really cool work on the ground. Um, you know, we serve American food, cheeseburgers, and milkshakes, stuff that you can't get anywhere else. And uh, it's, it's really become like a hub of activity where we get to plug into all these projects that are coming through Uganda and find ways that we can help them. Um, that's one of the most important things we're doing right now is coming alongside organizations that are doing good work, giving them a hand. You know, you get a, you get a team of volunteers that comes over for two weeks. They want to work with kids. They're working in the villages. They're working in clinics. They all come with their your MacBooks and their iPods yeah, yeah. and their iPhones and everything. They're all hyped up plug it into crappy Ugandan power, and next thing you know, you got no laptop. Oh. Well, suddenly, it's like all your work comes to a standstill. You know, they're used to blogging every day and talking to their supporters. They're off the grid. And we help them out. You know, we do hardware repairs. We help them with their internet stuff. And it's kind of... It's kind of menial work, you know, it's not super high tech, but it's absolutely critical to the work that they're doing. Yeah, it's honorable stuff too. So what's what's your latest initiative? What are you doing with the, the hacker community? Now, one of the things that we're going to launch tomorrow, uh, you guys actually get an exclusive, so we haven't, Thank you. we haven't talked about this yet. Um, it's, a, it's an initiative called InfoSec Without Borders. It's kind of a play on doctors. Okay. You know, doctors. How, do, how does it work? The idea is pretty straightforward. We have lots of volunteers that want to do cool work, and we've had no way to do it. What we're doing is we're offering a way to do it. Okay. You know? um, we've got some corporations that have signed up that said, hey, we're willing to pay for man hours for our employees to do work for charities. So what we're going to do is we're going to use that as one piece of it, but we also have a mechanism for volunteers that aren't working so that they can do things like security scans. We have their work done through a proxy. The logs are actually going to be analyzed afterwards to see if they did anything crazy. Okay, so if you're a pen tester for an organization or if you're just a freelancer and you've got downtime, you want to donate your time, get some, gain some experience and, and do something charitable, how do you get involved and, and how do you hook those people up with organizations and what organizations that, that need that kind of pen testing work? Uh, there's so many. We focus on the small organizations. The big organizations have budgets. They can, they can properly hire an organization to come and do the stuff. We focus on smaller ones and we really like the ones that are on the ground in Uganda where we can actually see See where the money's going. Yeah. If you work for a company and you're doing work already in the infosec field, the way that you approach this is you work with your company and say, hey, we've there's a really cool organization. Would you be willing to donate some of my work hours to help out? That's how you approach. If you're an individual and you're not working, you come to us as a volunteer. But either way, the place that you check it out is infosecwithoutborders.org. Nice. Johnny, it's so great to see you. I love getting the updates on all the great stuff. You guys have been doing this tremendous work with IHAC Charities for coming on like five years now? Like five years. Yeah. yeah. Dude, it's a pleasure seeing you. Awesome. Great Thank to you. see you again. Thanks so much. Join modding wizard Ben Heck and friends as they build and modify a host of amazing community inspired creations. And be sure to check out the new episodes of the Ben Heck Show every two weeks right here at revision3.com slash tbhs. In the latest episode, Google sends Ben the new Android ADK for Android and he builds an Android powered baby rocker. Now stay tuned to element14.com slash tbhs to find out how you can enter to win Ben's latest builds from his show. Well, let me share a secret. Hey, boy, look at him. Or maybe six, four, five, six.
to defeat me. My beat needs a regular expression. Be a breeze. But please be, beat me. I'm about to lose my mind. He's got JVM tracks. They compile just in time. Got a mobile block. Now he's maxing out the load. My guitar hero blows. Always heating up the notes. Breaking the controls. I take him to my shows. The drum cell is one. Got the major head explode. Boom, boom. A headshot. Every time I go, it's all around. Spectrum I shouldn't be on, but I'm on. Yeah, sweet. Yeah. For Hack 5, I'm Darren Kitchen at DEF CON 2011 with the man that means, need, no, needs the, 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 the. Yelling too loud. I'm yelling. For DEF CON 20, for, for Hack 5, I'm doing, yeah. I know how to do this. I've done it before. 